Hello and welcome back to the Kakasa with IFRIS tutorials. In this video, we look at fiscal document management under IFRIS. This shall cover issuing of e-receipts and e-invoices, credit notes and debit notes. Be sure to have watched the previous video covering stock management. The links can be found in the description space below this video. Next, I'm going to show you how you issue a debit note against an invoice. So note, with a debit note, we are increasing the invoice amount. For instance, if someone made a payment that is in excess of the quantity of the commodities you gave to that person, they can come back and then you issue a debit note against that invoice. So I will show you how you do that. Go to Fiscal Document Management, under Debit Notes, select Request Debit Note. So. At this point, we have all the debit notes that have been issued in this system against your invoices, but we need to issue a new one, so you click on Add. So after clicking on Add, you can search to see all the invoices that you have against which you can issue debit notes. In this case, I will select an invoice against which I want to issue this debit note. So I will select the invoice and then click apply. So it will take me to the next page where I have section A, seller information, section B, buyer details, section C, goods and services. Now in this section, our interest is on uh, adjusting the quantity of commodity because for instance, someone made a payment for 30 bags of cement but when your warehouse was loading bags, that person received 20 bags. So when, if that person comes back and they require you to top up that, the difference of the cement that you provided, you can issue a debit note to indicate that you've added that person another 10 bags to make the 30. So how do you do that? Go to section C, select the item that you want to adjust and then click modify. So it will show you the quantity of the bags of cement that you want to add to that person. As you can see, you have all the, the rest of the details. Hema cement, uh, unit of measure is bags and unit price is 26,000. So the question is, how many bags do you want to add to this invoice? So you will say, I want to add 10 bags. So you will select quantity as 10, and then you can check the tax component and see the effect. If everything is okay there, then click save, and then it will show you that you've added 10 bags to this invoice. So you click next, take you to the next page, where you will be required to give a reason why you're issuing this debit note. So you will come and give your reason. In case your reason is not among the ones listed here, you can still select other and then give your reason. But I will use this first one as my reason. And then I will go through the tax amounts and confirm that everything is okay. And then after I will put the attachment. For example, if they require me to attach the original invoice, I'll click on that item, click Upload, click Select, select the invoice, and then Upload. So after uploading, you will see quantity has changed to one, which implies that my invoice has been uploaded successfully. Then I will come to the next part and submit. Once I've submitted, and I get the successful prompt from the system, it implies that I've got my debit note issued against the invoice. As you can see here, we have the 10 bags that have been added to the original invoice. So I will also show you how you go and see all your debit notes under fiscal document management, request debit notes, and if you search, you will see all your debit notes. So you just click, it will take you to this part where you can see the original invoice. Click on view to view the original invoice. 
and then section B to view the debit note. And that's how we issue a debit note against an invoice. I hope this video has been helpful to you. In the next tutorial, we look at reports management under IFRIS. The links to these videos can be found in the description space below this video. In case of any inquiries, don't hesitate to email us or call us using the contacts across your screen. Be sure to hit the subscription button and notification bell so that you don't miss any tax-related videos. Uganda Revenue Authority. Developing Uganda together.